Master Ken here with another episode of Master Ken's Privates. With me today is McDojo Light, which is just like a regular dojo, but with half the calories. Uh, I don't know how he got booked on the show, but now that he's here, I guess we'll put him on. My only problem is I checked out your Instagram page and I only see you doing call outs, uh, making fun of other martial artists and who does that? Uh, normally we have real martial artists on the show. So do you have any proof of your skill? Well, I noticed you have a pair of nunchucks. Yeah. I happen to have two here myself. Well, give us a quick little demo then. Sweaty. It's hot in here. We'll turn on the air conditioning. Hey guys, it's Rob with McDojo Life. Uh, I got brought on to show you guys a little bit about the nunchucks. So these are pro chucks. So if you notice the strings are just a little bit shorter. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna teach you just a little bit about how to use these as opposed to the longer string. So if you notice, whenever I hold this in my hand, I can actually control the other end of the stick, unlike the ball bearing ones, which you wouldn't be able to really do that. Now there's a lot of things that I can do, but what I'm gonna show you guys how to do is do a hand roll. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the tuck, the chuck that I'm holding on to. I'm gonna take my thumb, put it next to where the string is, that's my marker, and then that should be about how the distance between my hand and the string. This is gonna allow me to throw my hand into the, the hand roll. So all I really need to do is just hold on to it with my thumb, let go with my four fingers, toss it over my hand. You'll notice it makes that little triangle. I let go, now there's nothing holding on to it but gravity. Now my thumb turns down and I can grab a hold of the other stick. So it should look kinda like this hand roll. Now whenever I'm done with that I can take it and bring it across the front of my knuckles going this way and do the exact same thing I just let go. Now I have a hand roll. Now if I do that back and forth I have one then the other, one then the other. Try it. Alright so my first problem with McDildo's technique over there is the flashiness of it without the practicality. You notice when he does the hand roll he's only ever able to probably strike with one end of the ninjaku at a time. That's my problem with this pro chuck bullshit, okay? Uh, a standard ninjaku has a longer string or chain that allows for you to grip it, okay? Uh, I, I tend to feel like when it comes to the length of your chain or string, size matters. It's like the old saying, you can walk softly and carry a big stick, but if your stick is too little for people to be impressed, just attach a chain to it and then attach another equally small stick. I'm paraphrasing. Um, so anyway, I like to use a move called the California roll. This allows me to strike with both ends of the stick at the same time, like so. Okay, that's what I like about that. The other problem I have with his technique is that he doesn't seem concerned at all with being disarmed. Uh, you do all that tournament bullshit in the street, you're going to get your nunchaku taken away from you. And on none, of the, none of the systems out there actually teach nunchaku disarms. Can you name one? I can't. So, uh, let's bring uh, Mr. Flippy Dippy in here. Um, so, there's a two-step process to disarming any nunchaku series of techniques. So, do your flippy stuff. Step one, create a distraction. Okay. Step two, all you got to do is throw in the towel. And then, of course, restomp the groin. All right, I want to thank Ronald McDojo for coming on to the show. It wasn't my idea. And uh, letting me make him grimace by snapping his nuggets. So. Appreciate that. Follow his bullshit, uh, whatever this is here. And uh, otherwise, that's another satisfied customer of Meridote. Tune in again soon for another episode of Master Ken's Privates. And do that hand roll. That's pretty good, right? That's not bad.
Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. You can follow us on Instagram and Facebook. You can purchase Master Ken and Todd Enter the Dojo Show merchandise at enterthedojoshow.com. You can book a live appearance with us at masterkenlive.com, and you can get deleted scenes and outtakes on our Patreon. <laughs> Restop the drawing.